guys, it's Yumi. So today I'm going to be doing a what's in my school bag to, have to start off. I just want to talk about a couple of things. Um, first off, the colors on my nails. And this is what I have on my nails right now. It's like a really pretty royal blue and it's really shimmery too. It's from Misha. That's what I have on my nails. And second, I did have school today and the reason for that was because um, we had a snow day and I live in Chicago and our district never ever calls a snow day and this is the first time we did so right now we have literally 18 inches of snow and i'll insert some photos right now well, the weather right now is really cold um hopefully you guys will all stay warm and we'll be safe Alright, so let's get started with the tag. This is my school backpack, and I have this um, in 7th grade, so that was like 4 years ago, I'm a junior now, and I really don't like this bag, it's a transport bag, um, I'm going to get a new bag when I graduate high school, so yeah, it's a puff painted over here, and my friends were on my bag, so yeah. I'm just going to start off with this small pocket over here. First off, I'm just going to start with the lotions that I have in this bag. And first I have, um, okay. First I have this body lotion and it's called Beautiful from Estee Lauder. And it's a perfume body lotion. It smells really good. It smells really good. Next lotion that I have is this one and I got lots I get lots of compliments on this lotion. And it's from Bath and Body Works and it's a holiday tradition tradition festive vanilla fig. And it smells very vanilla. -y. <laughs> and inside this pocket right here, I just keep my phone in here, my iPod and um just my keys bunch of keychains here. So that's all I have in my that's all I have in my small pocket. Now going on to the big one, I'm gonna show you guys how I organize my stuff. So yeah. Uh, first thing I see is my I guess it's called makeup bag because I don't really need makeup. But this is the bag that I put all my um all my the gloss and mirror and all this stuff in here. So I got this bag Korea. It's a very Korean traditional style bag. Korean has pre designed all um, going down the middle and this little keychain thing. So let's zip it up. And first thing I have is this mirror. And I got this free and the thing is broken in the middle. So let's just open it here. And then it's a two sided mirror. Um, I have Four lip products. First, I have um, the Nivea Kiss of Smoothness um, chapstick, and I had this like a month. I bought this a month ago, and I'm almost done using it. I'm obsessed with chapstick. Um, I have the EOS lip balm, and this is the mint on, and I am almost running out of that too. Lip gloss, and this is from Maybelline. This is number 35, Pink Reflection the color I'm wearing on my lips right now um and then I have this really cute packaging um lip balm and this is from beauty credit and yeah this is how the packaging looks like so cool and then I have some random papers and stuff in this let me show you guys my pencil case and this is my pencil case I got this at borders um last summer and I really love pencil cases and stand, um, stationary things so yeah I'm going to just show you guys a couple of pencils that I really 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 love I got these all in Korea and these are not the typical mechanical pencils you'll see in America or anywhere else so first off I'll show you guys these pencils and one is green and one is blue and they look like pens, but they're really not. They have a cap. So, that's okay, I have this really pretty peachy lead pencil. Pencil. Yep. And 
last one I love is this one and has green and white. Um, it's green and white. So these are my favorite pencils and taking notes at school I always need highlighters. So these are my favorite ones that I love and I suggest you guys buy some different colors of um, like pens and stuff because it will really be helpful and it will help you concentrate when you're trying to study and looking back through your notes. So first I have these and I got this at Korea and they're just kind of like gel pencils, gel, gel pens and this is gray and this is green. Then I have these pencils, um, these dry safe markers and they have really thin points. So, and they don't smudge either. And these are the Tri Plus Fine Aligner. These are the colors that I have. So, that's all I have for this pencil case. Uh, one way I keep um, organized is using a planner. And this is the one that my school gave us. I'm not going to show you. This is how it looks like. So then I'll write down the classes that I have. And I'll write them in order of like U.S. history, Spanish, algebra, physics, and liter American literature, and these. Um, I just write them in order, and these are the only classes I have, like actual classes. So what I'll do, I'll just write down the homework that I have, and I'll just kind of scratch them off after I'm done doing the homework. So it keeps me very organized, and I really love. This is probably like the only thing that I use. I have a couple of uh, binders and stuff in here. So first off, I'm just going to show you guys the Spanish binder. And this, I got this at Walmart, and it's the Studio C binder, and it has really full, pretty full prints. Inside it has um, pretty polka dot design. And yeah, when you have binders, always, 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 always get dividers. So I have these color dividers, and I like them if you want, but... So this is my Spanish binder. What I'll do, I'll whatever I that's not hole punch, I'll just put it in, in this little pocket over here, and I'll put my uh, newest homework in the first page. So I can just take that right out if my teacher asks me for the homework. Next to love it, and um, this sheet would be my return homework. First tab, second tab would be my notes. Third tab would be vocab. So yeah, that's how I organize myself, and it's very easy just to take them out. And yeah, next I have uh, this folder thing, and I got this at an Asian supermarket. My friend bought this for me for Christmas, and it says Beast, and it's a Korean band. And for this is for physics. I have a lot of stuff. My physics teacher gives me and I'll just put my latest packets in here and I also have another divider that's like really like literally like this thick and I'll just whatever that's not for homework I'll put that in that binder so it's just much easier for me to carry this small folder than other than my big pack binder. Last thing I'm going to show you guys um, is this binder and this is for my American literature class. It's kind of faded but yeah. This and yeah. calculator. It has a cute Hello Kitty sticker right here. This is the latest book that I'm reading and it's oh ah, okay. And it's the House on Mango Street. This book. I'm not really a fan of it. <laughs> and last thing I'm gonna show you guys is here. And I love chewing gum. I always need something in my mouth. And so I have a bunch of gum here, but the weird thing about me is that I don't chew a full piece of gum. I always use like this much because, first of all, chewing gum makes your jaw bigger. So I don't want to chew a full piece. I just want to just chew this one, and this is just enough for me. And when I'm done, uh, I just put them in here, all the wrapper, in this little pouch. So it'll be just easier to just throw this out. Oh yeah, 
that was my what's in my school bag tag. I hope you guys enjoyed and thank you guys so much for watching.